So uh, I watch a lot of interracial porn. <laughs> yeah, not for the sex. I just want to see a black man interview a white woman for a job. <laughs> yeah. In some. <laughs> In some points, the black dudes that have better jobs have never seen black dudes have in real life. <laughs> it's be like lawyers, business owners, cello instructors. <laughs> I never seen a black cello instructor. <laughs> I actually only know two black people with job security. My mom, a city worker for 30 years, and Kenan Thompson. <laughs> yeah, it didn't go through. Uh, um, one thing I was looking forward to is uh, Harriet Tubman being on the $20 bill. Yeah, I think that would have been dope, especially for rap music, because Make It Rain would have been referred to as emancipation precipitation. <laughs> yeah, I love that joke more than I love my girlfriend. <laughs> um, I've been a little bit depressed lately because I'm awake, and um, I think it's hard for black men especially to talk about depression because we have so many cool words available to us to undermine how we really feel, you know? Like a couple years ago, I was having suicidal thoughts and depression, and uh, I checked myself into a psych unit, and I know you guys are looking at me like Jordan, but you're so handsome <laughs> and well put together. But you know what they say, black don't crack, only psychologically. <laughs> but I got out of the psych unit, and a friend of mine was like, are you okay, man? Is everything all right? But I had so many cool words available to me. I was like, yeah, I was just tripping. <laughs> but I wasn't just tripping. I had a severe mental breakdown. <laughs> If anything, I might have been bugging, but I wasn't tripping. <laughs> yeah. I, um, one thing brought me joy recently. I, I found out that my girlfriend's mom got robbed in Kenya on a Groupon safari. <laughs> yeah. I heard that, I was like, damn, sounds like I got a new joke. <laughs> That's what you get, Susan. <laughs> you know, sometimes God closes the door to open the window, and then a Kenyan man jumps in that window <laughs> and robs your girlfriend's mom, and you get a new joke. <laughs> I actually found out uh, actually wasn't a Kenyan person. It was actually a white man who was also on the Groupon safari. And I heard that it made me so happy. I was like, damn, white people also can't afford to go on vacation. <laughs> and my mom doesn't like that joke. <laughs> This actually happened to me recently. I was uh, pulled over by the cops in the cab. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know they could do that either. <laughs> uh, they put on their lights, poop, and the cab driver was like, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm good. <laughs> they came to shine the lights in the back seat, like, I'm sorry, I just want to make sure this guy's all right. We had some robberies at gunpoint tonight. And it made me nervous, like, as a kid, like, cops would come to my school and read books to us, but, like, in that moment, I felt like I was in a Dr. Seuss book that was trying to demonstrate racism to children, you know? It's just like, cop, I am, I am, cop, I am. <laughs> I do not like black man or woman. <laughs> I would not like them on a boat. I would not like them on a goat. <laughs> I would not like them eating cookies. I would not like them wearing hoodies. <laughs> I would not like them anywhere, to be honest, <laughs> except maybe my fantasy basketball team. <laughs> They came over like, where you coming from? I was like, a comedy show. They're like, where you going to? I was like, a comedy show. They're like, oh, you're a comedian? Tell me a joke. And I was like, you just pulled over my cab? <laughs> Nigga, that's the joke. That's all you get. I'm from uh, Queens, New York, and uh, yeah, actually recently found, it didn't go through either, but I actually found out that Amazon was gonna bulldoze a building. I told a girl I love you in as a teenager to make room for their new headquarters. So their foundation would have literally been built on a lie. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I never loved you, Kendra. <laughs> I love free shipping, you goofy bitch. <laughs> Guys, great and Jones, thank you.